Hey guys, so today is a very exciting day because I am finally going to pick up my little baby girl. Oh. Feels like so long since I last went to see her um, and we're obviously away in Scotland so we couldn't go and get her before that. So I was so excited the whole time in Scotland. I was just like, I just want to go home to get my puppy. <laughs> So yeah, I got like an hour and 50 minute drive to go and get her this morning. She was the only girl in the litter and I've always wanted a little girl, a little toy poodle. That's what she is. I can't wait for you guys to meet her. I'll tell you what her name is in a bit because I've had her name for a while. I still can't believe I'm going to have a puppy by the end of today. I've known I've wanted a toy poodle for a long time now and my living situation and my work situation is the perfect time to have a dog right now. So yeah. Let's go and pick up my little baby. This top is from Topshop, by the way. I feel like I'm gonna get lots of questions on this. <laughs> Did it go front to back? Oh, hi, baby. Right. Well, I think that was oh, going to be the safest thing. Baby. Yeah. Yeah. The wedge completely. Oh. Yeah, I just need to take my jumper off. Oh, what do you do? Oh, oh, Ow. <laughs> thousands of what they call Do you know about the yes. you know about gun tippings? This is a little window inside the door. And, and then they, they buy the little pieces of paper. They buy. Hi. Okay, we've put a cat belt on her collar to start with. <laughs> just because she's so tiny and we don't want to stand on her. Florence, hey! What is that? This is your home, baby. What do you think? <laughs> You're not sure? You're so tiny. Oh, have you seen yourself? Oh, who's that? Who's that? Huh? Who's that? Who's that? Who is that? Who is that? Is that you? You <laughs> She keeps seeing herself in the mirror. Is that you? Oh, lovely. 
Yes, thank you. The little Florence was pretty good last night. Wasn't too much squealing. <laughs> Although I've just left her in her crate to go upstairs, do my makeup. And there's poo all over the crate. Yeah, that's nice, isn't it, Florence? Can't wait to clean that up. Hello. <laughs> it's a good job you're so cute, isn't it? Hey. Oh, hello. So I haven't really spoken much about Florence. That's her name. Hi. Hi Florence. Are you gorgeous? Yes. So Florence is a little red toy poodle and she's nearly 10 weeks. We're going to the vets on Tuesday to get her checkup and possibly her um, next set of vaccines. And then a few days after that, she'll be able to go outside in public places. She's allowed to go in our garden, um, but she gets very interested in everything except um, doing her business in the garden, basically. <laughs> but she's been trained on newspaper, um, so we're using that instead of puppy pads for now. She just loves licking. Oh, yes. So we're gonna go and buy a slicker brush today, which is the type of brush that's meant to be good for poodles. That's what the breeder suggested, isn't it? Let me give you a good brush. Yeah. I gave her a brush last night with her little puppy brush, but it's not really very good for poodle fur. <laughs> so yeah, poodles need lots of maintenance with their coat because it can get matted very quickly. Um, and it's good to get them used to like brushing and everything before they have to be groomed because you've got to be groomed at some point, otherwise You'll be a massive ginger ball of fluff. She does look quite big for a toy poodle puppy, but um, toy poodles actually aren't toy dogs. Um, they're not in the toy category, which is, I don't know why they call them toy poodles, but they're the smallest out of the poodles. There's like the standard poodle, then the miniature poodle, and then the toy poodle, which is what Florence is. I know there's probably gonna be comments about how I shouldn't get a puppy and I should adopt and I did look into adoption, but I think people should be allowed a puppy at some point in their life. And if I get on really well with Florence, I might adopt another toy poodle down the line to keep her company. So yeah, I just wanted to have the experience of having a puppy. She came from a really good breeder, didn't you? Only girl in the litter. So you had loads of annoying brothers. Yes. Mm. So yeah, I'm going to end the video there. I'm going to carry on filming this week to see how the first week goes with Florence. But right now I need to go and clear out her crate, which is full of dog poo. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye. Bye. <laughs>